if it's been a long time coming, talk us through that. Yeah, honestly, I can't put it into words to be honest. To be out for so long with an injury and then to make my first league appearance since last season and get a goal, honestly, it's, I got a bit emotional, but when the lads piled on top of me, <laughs> no one could really tell, but it's brilliant, I really enjoyed that. Well, it was special for the team as well, when Luke Simpson sprinted you know, 100, 110 yards to, to join in with you. Yeah, me and Luke have got a really good bond. Uh, we're travelling together every day to training, so I think he, he you know, he, he really realised how much that meant for me to come in and play and, and get a goal on, on top of that, which I didn't expect, and I'm sure no one else did as well. You, you, you've taken those as you football's a, a, a funny game, a weird game. It takes so much out of you trying to get back from from injury. And I know we spoke at Spanning more, but yeah, just how special is this today on, 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 at Agborough? Yeah, for a long, such a long journey of being out for eight months, um, no one realises how tough it is and how lonely it is. And you realise why sometimes players go into depression and you know it's, it's a lonely world, but to come out on top and have an, an appearance like that on my comeback, it, it honestly couldn't get any better. Couldn't get any better. You, you look at the, the result today, I know as we were going in, I, I didn't see Sixton against Southport. Southport themselves, yeah, they, they haven't been on the best of runs, admittedly, but uh, a performance you know, from Harriers that, that, that really put them to the sword. Yeah, it was both of us. Uh, us and Southport have kind of been on the same form, as you may say. So today was a bit of a flip of, coin, flip of the coin at first, but we knew we were at home. We needed to stamp authority and really take them to the sword, and which we did. And the lads were absolutely brilliant from minute one to the... 96 minute, whatever we played, um, every single one of them. And the scoreline, I think, kind of, it could have been more. It could have been more. And that's down to us, really digging deep and pulling our sleeves up and doing what's needed to, to push on. And the, uh, no, mathematically, still a little bit to do, but that victory almost uh, guaranteed Harry as a place in the playoffs. Yeah, um, we try not to get too far ahead of ourselves in a way, even though we've got kind of one eye in the playoffs. Uh, for us, we're taking one game as we go, and every every game is a cliche, but it's a cup final now. So now we've obviously we've had the Southport game, and uh, we're going to the next one. That's right. And a, a little bit more time to, to to get yourself rested, to get yourself recovered. Uh, Chester is the, the Friday night game now in the, on the bank holiday, and uh, you've got their full of confidence, I think, Ooh. after this. Performance. All right, guys. Yeah, definitely. Uh, it's one of those situations where we've obviously changed formation today, so it kind of gives us time to really get into training and and work on whatever the gaffer tells us to do um, and to be fair to the lads who did brilliant in a short space of time building up to this game so now we've got a bit of a break that help us massively. Well, congratulations to Dave, we'll let you jump back. Cheers, thank you, appreciate that. I know you said briefly as well Cliff that it, it was more kind of about building minutes and, and building time on the pitch for you so I mean the goal as an individual moment must be the, must be the blessing for you. My eyes light up when situations like that come up so if I get a chance and I smell it I'm taking it. And it's important to everyone, isn't it, in the sense that the goal difference, goal score, all these things could yeah. make a difference at the end of the season. Hundred percent. We want to give ourselves every advantage that we can that we can get. Um, so if it means scoring goals, keeping clean sheets, in whatever way, at the end of the day, we don't want to leave no stones unturned uh, going forward.